All right, good morning. So, it's been a rough morning. You guys, uh, if you guys saw, did that video at, you know, two something in the morning, got it uploaded. Probably got to bed around, uh, <laughs> probably got to bed around like three, 3.15. Didn't really get much sleep. Um, actually, I probably got to bed later than that. I think it was like uh, 4.45 like by the time I finally put myself in dream mode. Anyways. So I've got a Q, uh, uh, Android Q update for you. Um, basically, it, it's just going to be a, a quick update. Uh, a lot of the apps have upgraded um, and have kind of fixed all their bugs and stuff like that. That's pretty much where the problems are lying are, are lying with with this with this is that the apps need to to uh, merge with it. Uh, right now, I've got dark mode enabled. So, um, and, and this is only something that you can do when, you, if you want dark mode on Android Q, you've got to enable it before you upgrade to Q, okay? So, just a reminder, you gotta go into the developer settings and enable, um, when you, in Android Pie, you've gotta uh, update the um, dark mode in the developer settings. Um, in Android Pie before you can uh, before you upgrade Android Q, and then it'll be enabled because it's been taken out of Q, uh, but it'll it'll keep those developer settings remembered. Otherwise, it won't. Okay, so you'll have to do it beforehand. Otherwise, you just won't be able to do it. But it's great. Um, so it's working pretty well. M most things are, are dark mode, and basically what it is right now is that the apps are trying to also become dark mode. So the developers for the, all the apps and stuff like that have to get all their apps and stuff like that. The thing is, a lot of these apps are like Google apps that should be in dark mode already because Android's made by Google. So they should just do it already. It's kind of annoying. It's like, why aren't these the first apps? Like, why aren't these running seamlessly? But it's beta, I'm understanding, you know, whatever. If they wanna, if, if it's going to take them a little bit of time. It's going to take them a little bit of time. It's fine. Um, another app that doesn't work at all, um, the Wells Fargo app. So if you bank with Wells Fargo and you do a lot of mobile um, banking and you can't live without mobile banking, then do not install Q because you won't be able to use your thing. Now, luckily, I've got two phones, so it's no big deal. You know, I've got uh, a second phone that I can use that app on. Uh, like I said, this phone that I'm using right now, uh, I, I, I basically even bench testing this uh, this uh, Samsung Galaxy S10 E. It's so long to say. I wish it was like less things to say. Um, pixel, pixel, pixel. Easy. Samsung Galaxy S E 10 10 E. Who cares? Who cares about all that? But anyways, back to Q. Q's good. Um, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. Uh, they fixed a lot of the bugs. There were some bugs in Google Photos where like you couldn't read anything. And there's still some bugs here or there. They fixed a lot of the big ones. Um, they still need to do some work on it, but uh, things are getting better with that. I can definitely see everything in the app now. Uh, there, there, was a, there was a problem where they, they, they had shifted everything to dark mode, but they didn't shift the... Um, <laughs> They didn't shift uh, the, the, the font color to white, so, <laughs> or gray or whatever. You know, they didn't shift it to anything. So it was black too. So there's the black background with black things. It's like, ah, it's, it wasn't good at all. I can't read anything. And I couldn't. Uh, so that, that was a pain. But they fixed that. You can read some of the things. There's still a couple things that are weird and. Uh, the, the logo was weird, but now that's better. It's still kind of not right. It doesn't look 100% like, it doesn't look like, hey, sell me, you know? Um, but it looks okay. Uh, but a lot of the other things are good. I mean, I'm put, I'm running it on my daily driver. Now, luckily, um, I mean, that was, that, my Pixel 2 XL is my phone, okay? So right now, I've been using my work phone a little bit more, um, to get one because it's brand new and I want to test it out. Two, um, I also want to, um, you know, see what 
see what's good with the, uh, the Samsung Pixel, or Samsung Pixel, oh my gosh. Haven't had any sleep, you have to forgive me. The Samsung Galaxy S10e. But, um, but yeah, so I'm using it on my daily driver, and, uh, it's, it's okay. It's, it's more stable than you would think. Uh, there hasn't been any, like, big, like, glitches or anything like, oh, freeze, eh. The, the OS, the, the GUI is, is, mwah. it's nothing, nothing wrong. Now, I'm, <laughs> the thing is about that, now, I say this now, but basically, when they come out with the next beta update, it could be a whole other thing. <laughs> the next beta update could pretty much crap all over everything. They could have created more bugs than they fixed. I mean, it could it could be a disaster. So you never really know with betas. Um, so that's why before you enter and opt in to the beta, if you're going to do this, you've got to back up your phone 100%. Everyone online, everyone who beta tests recommends do not do it on your daily driver. I'm doing it on my daily driver because I did GAF and I, I sold my Pixel 1, so I've kind of got to do it anyhow. Um, but, you know, I mean, that's where we are with it. And it, it's it's good. I, I'm... I'm not I'm not sad and I haven't had to revert back or opt out. No, everything's good. So I wanted to give you guys a quick update because I know I've been slacking on the uh, Android Q updates. Um, but really, there really hasn't really been much um, other than, you know, some of the apps not working and uh, everything else working smoothly. Um, so, you know, other than all that, uh, I wanted to give you guys an update. I just <laughs> dropped my kid off at school. I had to get up early this morning. Um even after, uh, you know, doing all that. So just wanted to give you guys a quick update and, uh, I will, uh, I got, I got some more videos coming out today. So, um, stick around and, uh, stay tuned in because we are going to do all that goodness. Alrighty. All right. Thanks guys.